Brownian motion. Robert Brown observed that fine pollen grains suspended in water constantly moved in a zigzag manner. Similar phenomenon was also observed for many kinds of particles in liquids and gases. This type of motion is referred to as Brownian motion. This zigzag motion is due to unequal bombardment between the suspended particles and the molecules of the surrounding medium. The zigzag motion can be explained with the help of an example. Here you can see an isolated large particle A suspended in a solution. A number of molecules hit the particle A from all sides. On an average, the impact mutually cancels out. So the resultant force on the particle is zero. Now observe the particle B, which is very small. We observe that the number of molecules hitting B is less and is not hit equally from all sides. As a result, there is a resultant force. This resultant force alters the direction of the particle. As this particle moves, the direction of the resultant force changes. This results in a zigzag motion. Let us now understand Brownian motion with the help of an experiment. A hollow cube is filled with smoke particles and is placed under a low power microscope. Simultaneously illuminate the cube with a light source. The smoke particles appear as bright particles moving in all possible directions in contrast to the black background. This is an experimental evidence of molecular motion or Brownian motion.